So the first mission is finding our husbands <laughs> because yeah. we just shot an Arabic vlog together and our husbands have gone off just randomly. Oh, they've gone off. Where nice. We have no idea where they are. They left all the doors open. Okay, and they've gone off. So we left, we left them alone and they don't know how to keep, like, my husband speaks Arabic and her husband speaks English but somehow Multilingual conversations. Yeah, so I just said Britain Himar. <laughs> <laughs> trip. Adventure. We're going on a trip. <laughs> Adventure time. <laughs> oh. Is this our first Palestinian car? Yes. Go by Palestinian water. To Palestine. And we only have Palestinian hummus as well. You're like the Palestinian right, hummus, Palestinian water. <laughs> There's the border for West Bank. We're through, right? Yeah, no way. Look at the wall. So this is West Bank. We just made it. West Bank, yeah. Oh, this wow. is Ramallah specifically. Well, we made it in so easily. I know. Yeah. It's going back to uh, Israeli yeah, territory that's harder because uh, they don't care if you go there. They're scared yeah. of Arabs coming to them. Uh, they don't care about it. to hip to uh, Karina Kapoor. Yeah. I am married to my wife. Yeah. Me. Before he met me, he yeah. liked Karina Kapoor when he was a little boy, but now when he met me, he was like, oh my god. Salman Khan? You like Salman Khan? I'm only going to say Khan, this yeah. to be relatable. Gigi yeah? Hadid. Gigi Hadid. Gigi Hadid. <laughs> You're saying that like Ramallah hasn't been bombed before? No, it hasn't been bombed because like usually when it, it, it comes to bombing it's between Hamas and like the IDF so Hamas is like in Gaza so it's like really far so it's way too far like to like anyways Gaza can never shoot all the way here and they wouldn't bomb all the way here okay. anyways because it's Palestinians yeah. Um, so usually when I guess like they want to kill someone, <laughs> it yeah. sounds so bad. Yeah. They, they like go in and they like they, sh they they do like a lot of home raids and they like kill who they want here. Oh, wow. and they bring them back and then they leave. So they don't bomb. They just like go in and do their business and because they still have like um, military control over this territory, even though it's like political, like the government control is under the PA. Okay. Um, I think it's the PA. Anyways, uh, so it's under Palestinian authority, but. They still have military control of the IDF, so they can come in when they want, okay. whenever they want, and like do home raids whenever they want. Oh wow! Pretty much. So you might see soldiers here, but it's really rare. Oh okay, that's good. Because yeah. like Jerusalem, there's a lot yeah. everywhere. Yeah, because they like own it, you know, mm. technically, well, not really. They own it illegally, but they, they still have like ownership over it. But here they don't. We're in the West Bank. Let's do this. Is that ten shekel for a hijab? Yeah. Things here are extremely cheap, much cheaper than in... That's 10 shekels for a hijab. It's like £2.50. That's crazy. They're nice as well. They're really nice. It's in UK everywhere. Okay. Yeah, we are <laughs> you sure? Yeah. Got some corn, uh, but obviously we're doing that tipping, so inshallah we're gonna give him a big tip now, inshallah. So um what? inshallah. Palestinian crepe. 
delicious. What's this? Knef? Knefe. Knefe, which is with cheese. There's I a think. Turkish version of it. I'm surprised you didn't see it in Turkey, but in Turkey Maybe. it's a bit different. Knefe. Yeah. And this is a Palestinian waffle. It's so good. You like it? Yeah, it's so good, mashallah. <laughs> I'm doing surprised. Palestinian tea, shai, bilimon. Monana, which apparently is like a Palestinian drink. Li limonana? I don't know if it's limonada or limonana, but. Limonada is, is just lemonade. This is limonada with sake. Nana. Lemon Okay. I'm gonna try it. Bismillah. Mm. Mm. Oh my god. The mint is strong. It's tasty. It's really strong. Am I supposed to like shake it or something? Maybe you mix it. <laughs> that was a lot. I like it, Palestinians. Mm. <laughs> Despite my reaction, it's actually really good. It's just really strong. So halfway through our uh, our food, my husband's decided, uh, I need to brush up on Arabic. Let's do some drops. Asana. Raju Imra Fata 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 so Imam was really upset because he can't catch Pokemon in Palestinian neighborhoods. He can only catch Pokemon in Israeli neighborhoods, which is actually really sad. So during COVID, what did your husband do? So since everybody was stuck at home, he was like, yeah, pretending he was traveling. So he photoshopped like images and like sent it to everybody that he was in Paris and London and I don't know where else, in Moscow. Let's see. Let's see. <laughs> He's in Paris. <laughs> Where's uh, London or Moscow? Did they believe him? It's they did believe five, him. Yeah. Five days in, uh, in Paris. <laughs> five days in London. <laughs> <laughs> this is Photoshop, guys. This is not real. Lucky. <laughs> Moscow. Moscow. <laughs> <laughs> so we're in a mall and we're going to play Maghreb. 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 Let's do this. But yeah, now we're leaving. leaving. My husband is like, we need to leave. I'm um, teaching her. Urdu. And she's teaching me Urdu. I Pago? Pago. Pago. I'm so bad. I'm sorry. Pago is like Majnoon. It's like Majnoon. And Arabic. Ooh. Okay, now we're heading back to the car, and then yeah, we're gonna we're gonna leave, head back to Jerusalem. Hopefully, it's gonna be a smooth way back. Yeah, inshallah. Inshallah, I don't want a problem here. So we'll wait and see, I guess. Yeah, it's gonna be quite difficult to get back through, apparently. So, inshallah. <sighs> Foreigners. <laughs> Whoa. 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 Oh yeah. Getting to the border now, guys. Yeah, I'm gonna film it. This is the the wall right there. So now we're getting to the border. So you can see. All the cars are starting to like, just line up. It's a bit scary. We don't know if we're going to be let through. So. Inshallah, they'll let us straight through without asking for a passport. But you know, Inshallah. Depends you see the Israeli in. flags and everything. Yeah, it depends what mood they're in, to be honest. It depends like the soldiers, <laughs> what kind of mood they're in. If they want to let you go, they can let you go. I think we're letting us go. I'm not sure. So we got through really easily. Everyone was like saying it's gonna be hard for us, but alhamdulillah. I think the British passports maybe help, I don't know. Canadian passport. And too. Yeah, she pulled out her Canadian one. I she always pass out like, my Canadian one. Like, that was so funny because I was like, is she gonna do Canadian or Israeli? And then you were like, yeah. Canadian. Yeah, because my point is really they can see that I'm Jewish and whatever. Yeah. And then after it's like, why is she wearing a hijab? It's it's just, yeah. Alhamdulillah, yeah, but we got lucky. But I can see how it'd be hard for a lot of people to get through. We're saying bye now. Bye. If you ever want anything else, drive us somewhere and need any advice, you know, just text me. Whatever. Thank you. Message me, call me. Alhamdulillah. Yeah, home safe. Bye. Oh, thank you guys. Thank bye. You.
Yeah. 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 Oh, you yeah. just a hug. Please, if you come to London. Yeah. Alhamdulillah. Oh.